So today on Dark Souls, we are going to... Oh my god, we're really close to leveling up. While I'm leveling up, I'm going to talk about it. We are going to go all the way back to Blight Town. And our goal for today is to get the Tetsaiga. What? I know. Yes. You heard that correctly. We are going to go get the Inuyasha Sword. Because it exists in Dark Souls. And it is amazing, and I love it. And we will uh, sort of need it for something. And I want to use it anyway for something else. So let me spend all my souls at the same time and make everyone angry. Last time I did this, I got a lot of rage. But I like spending all my souls at once because I like seeing that number go flying up. And then we won't level strength anymore. So now that that's done, let me uh, put the Homeward Boons back on my bar. Let's put... Um, we got Bloom, Purple Moss Clump on our bar. We only have 10 more of those. Um, orange Guidance Soapstone. And we're going to put the White Sign Soapstone on our bar as well. And I guess we can go and equip these because why not? Yep, everything looks fine. All right, let's level. Um, endurance is 40. We don't need any more. Oh my god, we've already gotten strength in 30. I think that's good. Rack is stupid, rack is stupid. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this looks right. All right, another thing I need to clear up. Earlier, I said something about we would eventually be giving humanity to the lady. That is one possible thing we could do. Oh, also. Problems with that anymore. That's driving me crazy. All right, sorry. Um, I said something about giving humanity to the lady, uh, we are doing that specifically for a quest that I haven't been completely obvious we're doing, and I apologize for that. We're doing that for Solaire's quest. With the NPCs in this game, um, they have quests. Specifically, uh, Siegmeier or Kat Katarina has a quest that we are currently doing, and also Solaire of Astora has a quest that we are currently doing. And um, they are totally separate, they don't intersect at all, but in order to help them, we have to follow their route, so to speak. So one of the goals of what we're doing right now is to continue seeing Mario's quest, um, but we are going to go get something that will help with Solaire's quest, where we don't have to give the lady at that bonfire all of our humanity. And I'm wondering if I can do it this way, I've never actually tried to do it this way before, but... Uh, We'll see. But we need Tetsaiga for it. Um, or at least Tetsaiga will help with it. Alright. Now, let's uh, go this way, I think. It's a little dark. But we need to run across the um, far right wall coming through this place. And I kind of need to not piss off any giants. Have we made any giants mad yet? No, I don't think so. Alright. We need to equip... the rest of the Iron Ring. Because it specifically is needed for navigating the place we are going. Alright. And we are going to be getting a lot of... poison on us as per usual. But we're gonna do some hiking. And we need to hike through, um... Hike through this area yet again. Looks like you've had a rough day. Oh ho! Excuse me, I was so absorbed in thought I just drifted away. You see, I'm actually in a bit of a fix. I've made it this far. But I'm short on antidote moss for the trip back. Um, by my knighthood, I'm ashamed to ask. But can you spare a few scraps of moss? Oh yeah, totally. We got plenty of that. It's the other kind of moss clump I was worried about. Fantastic. Thank you. A saint you are. This knight of Katarina expresses his deepest gratitude. I shall not forget this. Please, take this. A symbol of my appreciation. The Pierce Shield. Well, our 
traits do seem entwined, don't they? Perhaps this, too, is the will of Lord Gwynne. <laughs> All right, that's all we need to do for Siegmeier. Can't level, didn't think I would be able to, all right. It's a long way down, so we're gonna have to uh, scale this thing from top to bottom. And there are goodies everywhere. So, I need to keep my eyes peeled for all of them. The most valuable of which being Twinkling Titanite on the uh, little guys. There's like a uh, miniature horde of the little guys on this thing. But let's see here. Uh, Alright, there's a corpse down there. Branch that goes around there. I think we can get down to that without any pain. Alright. What do you think about getting that corpse? Shouldn't be too bad. Yup. Just fine. Nice little tight night chunk for us. And then right here. Cool. There's a bunch of basilisks in that room and they will cause curse. As they are prone to do. However, if we swat them quickly, we don't have to worry about it. Swat. And just in case I do get cursed, I have a purging stone or two or three on me. As is good to have in case of the cursing. Alright. Um, I've gotten a little bit disoriented as to where we need to go now. Let's see. We could try jumping down to this branch. Oh, 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 ooh, I thought I fell off for a second. Alright. Red Titanite Chun, good. Good, 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 good. Um, It's very doubtful that I'll get everything inside the Great Hollow in one run. If there's anything I do miss that I need to get, I uh, am sort of counting on my viewers to tell me. Because it... Uh, it's a place I've never fully explored as far as I remember so um, all right let's see we need to go maybe a little bit further down um, okay let's okay all right good 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 and then there are two little guys down there but I think that one's gonna escape me yep he is uh, and I see a corpse all the way over there. Hmm. Not sure if I'm going to be able to get this one. This one looks a little far down. I could try it. I mean, no harm, no foul, right? Uh, uh. Yeah, I, think, I, I can do it. I, I can do it. 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 White Titanite Chuck. All right. So far in our tree exploration, things have gone rather smoothly. Um, I'm pretty sure I fell off like ten times trying to do this last time. And then that has gotten us exactly where we need to be to get to that next thing. Look at that. Perfect. A blue titanite chunk. Um, all right. Let's take another jump down. Right here. Another look see. That ladder is very important to remember for later. When we have to uh, come back. Actually, no, we don't even have to use the ladder to get back. Spoilers, though. I'm not going to explain exactly why we don't need to use the ladder to get back just yet. Oh, okay. Yep. That one was one that was not going to happen for us. Um, not sure if it's worth making another attempt to get that. I don't remember what that was. But, uh, we can see. So I guess it was important that we remember where that ladder was. 
in case we did fall down and miss that. <laughs> 